This is one of the most common mistakes that I see React developers make when they're working with server components. So over here, we have an app component, and then we have this count state variable here, which means that we need client side functionality, which is why at the top here, we put use client. And then we're using that inside of the body of this component. Now, here's the problem with this approach. Because we put use client here at the top of this file, this makes this file a client component and everything else that it imports, including the server component here. The server component, as you can see, is a simple server component that's supposed to live on the server. But because we put use client here at the top, we're now forcing this component to be also on the client which doesn't really make sense because if you look at the code, the only thing that is required to be on the client is this count state variable here and then the code that actually access it. So this isn't good. Instead, a better approach is to actually extract everything that is client specific into a separate component and put only that on the client. Like we did here, we have our count state variable, we have the same code that accesses it and here we can put use client. And then in our main component, we can just remove all of the client side functionality. We can remove use client at the top and we can directly import and use our client component. And this is a much better solution.